Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play the greatest game of all time, Beautiful Catamari. And in the last episode, we, we're we rolling up a storm, man. I really don't anticipate this game lasting very long, especially since I know what I'm doing. And why am I not reading these to pick up to get the best points possible? I really didn't think the, um, my first playthrough of this game, pretty much played it non-stop, me and Josh. I don't remember it really being about the points. I remember it being more about getting the right size. So I'm going to try not to worry about this. That's around the house. Okay, so there's luxury items, but also something else. See, the yarn, string, and loopy stuff. Ah, that's what you want. You want yarn and string. Well, let's do it. Allow me. Well, I can't pick that up. Let's see. Let's start small, dude. Let's start small. Okay, it's obviously not. Hey, we got something. Hey. Okay, so they're upset that, uh... I just cut them off. Okay, I understand being upset over that. I can't tell you the last time I got cut off, but uh, I probably didn't like it. Look at all those chickens. All this yarn. Oh my god, this is a cat's paradise, dude. Imagine if I took my cat and I dropped them in a house full of yarn. What in the world would I... What kind of doors would I be opening, man? I don't even know. I'm pretty, I'm pretty much on lockdown right now. I can't even move. All right, but yeah, just pick up everything, ladies and gentlemen. Any, any, just, just pick it all up. It doesn't matter if it's what color it is. Just pick them up and, and take them out on a nice day. You know what I'm saying? Oh gosh, all this stuffing and yarn and oh god, the colors. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dude, Anna, today, I freaked her out, man. Like, it looks like I do every day. All I gotta do is breathe around her, and she loses her friggin' mind. But, uh, <laughs> what happened was, uh, I was talking to her about stuff, and we are you know, just talking, having a good time. And, uh, eventually, I, I just looked at her, man. And, like, th this is the kind of conversations her and I have. I said, Anna, dude, man... I just want to be you. I just, I just want to wear your skin like that. And she looked at me like she had seen a ghost. <laughs> it's like, no, why would you do that? No. And she's just, it's just funny. It's just hilarious. And we already won. How about that? So much yarn. So little time, dude. Look at all this. Look at all those chickens. I'm imagining that there's, there's something hid somewhere in here. I'm going to find it. I'm going to get it. I'm going to find it. Or I'm going to find it. Then I'm going to get it. You know what I'm saying? There's got to be, gotta be, a, 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 there's gotta be a, a cousin here somewhere. Between, somewhere between all this yarn. Can I go outside yet? Or is this just like the, the lot of my life? Oh, I just got a box. Oh, that's good. A box. All box and no cousins. You know what I'm saying? I can't go outside. I probably can't go outside. Can I? Eventually you can go outside. I mean, well, yeah, I can. Yeah. Get, oh, well, can I? Uh, maybe not. There's jack-o'-lanterns out there, man. Oh, there we go. Coats! Winter coats. I'm down. All right. Thermal underwear. I saw thermal underwear be a thing. Okay, the really big balls of yarn, I don't think you can pick those up. Like, there's some things, man, a Katamari is just not meant to pick up. You know what I mean? But I've yet to find it, so let's just pick it all up, dude. Right, we got the bundles. We got large bundles. I guess we could go outside. You just got to be big enough to pick up the large bundles. All right, all done. That's a. I would say that's a pretty dang huge Katamari. That's. I mean, we pretty much picked up everything in the house. Anyway, and it was mostly yarn. Looks like. Look how you've grown. Not you. We're talking about the Vega cat. Vega. Vincent Vega. Thread and cloth. Yeah, it is. Tell me what it is, man. Envelope, please. Woo! 100 points. Man, I think that's perfect. I think it is. Bravo, bravissime. Arriba dirce. Long winding road has been. Yes, it has. But I have grown into uh, quite the man. As necessary. Swim it over to K. Dude, you got it, man. Dude, you throw that thing up in the sky and you make a planet out of it, man. But you know what kind of bothers me? Oh, that's pretty. Um. This, uh. King of the Cosmos is all. Yeah. 
you help me do all this stuff. And he's literally just laying back on a moon and watching me do everything. I feel like if you destroyed the universe, it should be at least a little bit of your responsibility to help fix it. At least a little bit. Alright, so let's see what he wants from us. But yeah, man, we're, uh... We're almost done with the 360 games, man. That's that's crazy, man. I remember when I first started Let's Play, and I had this huge stack of games right over there, and there's still an imprint on the carpet from where they sat for so long. But, man, it's all things that come to an end sometime. The rules are different this time around, though. This is not... It's not what you roll or how you just call it. Okay. You have to get it to exactly the size we say. Not too small, not too big, and surely not too easy. Ooh, it's exciting. Take a little problem. We don't actually know how big the Katamari is now. We'll sort of lost track and is more fun this way. There is no time limit. You just get it exactly 20 centimeters. That's that's about this big. What? Uh, oh, okay. I got, oh, okay. You're giving me a... Okay, yeah, I got you. All right. You hit the X button when I'm done. All right. I always thought this one was a little bit different. But, oh, excuse me. Mr. Airplane. Mr. Airplane. Hey, no, it was not a Mrs. Airplane. You don't know. So this one, this this one's point is directly related to the size, not so much what you roll up, which is good news. That's good news. I'm, uh, technically, that's easier, but I guess it's also technically harder. Technically, it all depends on your definition of technically. It's like that. It's like that one strip club in uh, <laughs> in uh, was it Saints Row Four? Technically legal. <laughs> that's the best name for a strip club I have ever heard. Yeah. It, now, it, I know it looks like we're close right now, but I know for a fact we're not close at all. 20 centimeters, especially in this level, is actually... It takes, it takes a little bit to get. But, uh, dude, one of these days I'm going to understand what she's singing about this song. Okay, I think we're almost there, to be honest with you. Starting to starting to feel like it. Uh, just take care of this, and uh, yeah, I think I think we're there. I, I think. Yeah, I'm calling it, man. I'm thinking. I'm thinking that's right at it. You know, I try to compensate because you can't make the Katamari a perfect circle. So, like, if it's like wider over here and like shorter over here, try to compensate. Like, maybe it equals out to be about the same. Let's see how good my eye is. Does it measure up? Let's see. It should be. It should be truly 20 centimeters. And how much an awkward would be so embarrassing? Okay, so let's hope it's right. This seems promising. How much? Oh, it's really nice. What is it? Involve, please. 95 points, but how big is it? This is not going to tell me how big it is. That's the, the biggest C block I've ever. No, I'm kidding. Okay, well, honestly, if 100 points is the max, 95 points is about as good as it gets. So, I would say it was either a little bit over or a little bit under. Dude, how about that? How about that, man? I can't eyeball Katamaris. <laughs> I didn't know I had that skill. What is that? That is a compass. Oh. Oh, it was 20.6. Oh, my God. God, it's a little bit over, man. It's like one, one of those cards or one of those little pieces of wood too much. Dang it, man. That's about as close as that gets. That's pretty dang good. Especially for eyeballing it, I think. It's like Toby Keith says, I ain't as good as I once was. But anyway. Hey. We gotta start unlocking stuff. This is starting to worry me a little bit. I didn't think it really... Hindered or uh, I didn't think it weighed heavily on unlocking, like getting points. That doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. But no, let's, 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 let's might as well do the Lady Luck Casino. So we got here. Got to make a Venus, dude. I'm down. You know what they say? Boys are from Mars. And however, the rest of that little saying goes. This is not the place to talk about that. That is, that would be in your, um, 
Gym class, probably. So, what games you guys played? I'm probably going to work on Portal 2's achievements. I finally get a day off, man. <laughs> like, I got to tell you, there's nothing feels better than um, the night before your day off because you talk about partying down, dude. I'm going to get crazy. I'm probably going to watch a couple movies on Netflix, man. That's how crazy I'm going to get. Somebody's house says Glam Vibe is totally whatever. Sim simpatico. Yeah, simpatico with us. Oh, yes, the catamaran. 60 centimeters. In five minutes. If you roll it this big in this much time, then it is, and then it's all shiny. Collect expensive items, tons of them. Yes, they're all there's. Oh, dude, I'm, I am. Oh, dude, I, oh, how do you pick stuff up? <laughs> how do you pick stuff up in a Katamari game? I, I don't know. I do not know. Okay, so we got to get uh, expensive stuff. Okay, I can do that. I can, I can get expensive stuff. The problem is I'm not big enough to really pick up money yet. So I gotta, gotta, gotta work my way up, gotta pay my dues, so to speak, on the whole, uh, size front, <laughs> you know what I'm Yeah, not really, but alright, let's, uh, I imagine, uh, mandarins aren't very expensive. Well, I don't know, dude, if, uh, strawberry goes for 50 yen, that seems like a lot, dude. I realize, like, the American dollar is worth more than the Japanese yen, but I still feel like that's a lot of money. It's not like a hundred dollars. Like that's not what it's saying. It's hundred yen. Still, like, what is what is technically expensive in Japan? You know, that's what I'd like to know. Excuse me. Excuse me. Dude, is this it's an American right now? I can understand this. Dude, just so you know, Legos are not that expensive. Well, I mean, I'm I'm sure some collector sets are, but not not all. Not all, partner. Right, that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for pick up. Uh, people don't leave me alone. Anna, you need to. You know, I'm playing Katamari right now, man. What do you want? This is this is important. All right, we are we're breaking boundaries here, dude. We're changing the world, man. Nobody's ever played this game. Like nobody nobody knows about this game. This is the best game. Oh, it's a present. Get it, get it, get it. Get it. Plenty of time. It's like you don't need to rush, man. Why rush? I always like this level. There's something about this level. It just felt like it had a lot in it. And it's, oh, God! It's kind of hard to explain. I mean, I know every level has a lot in it, but it's just... Something about this just seemed... It seemed very... What's the word here? Um, it seemed very dense, you know? In a good way. Not a, not a bad dense, but a good dense. Um... We're running out of time, though. Dude, martinis are expensive, aren't they? I don't know. I don't drink them. But surely, surely they've got some kind of expensiveness to them. There we go. Yeah, no, let's not fall off the edge this time. Oh, no. Oh, my God. All right. Dude, the melons are expensive, man. It's like a couple thousand yen. We just got back from the supermarket, and that's true. Like, that was, that was, that was the deal. Anyway. Josh and I are not excited about the currency exchange aspect of all that. Um, I mean, we got to do what we got to do, right? <laughs> what are we going to do? Not go to Japan? <laughs> That's funny. That's that is that is the, actually the opposite of the option that we have. I mean, it's kind of in it's kind of in English. But anyway, I was talking to Savannah the other day, and she wants to go to Japan too. So now I find myself in a bit of a Sticky situation, or at least not yet. Um, excuse me, excuse me, ma'am, miss, missus, do you own this house? No, I don't think so. Get out of the way. I must roll up everything that I see, man. There needs, there needs do they make Katamari t shirts? I'm gonna buy one. I don't care what anybody says. I'm gonna wear it to work. It's like, oh, uh, Sam, that's not, uh, that's not uniform. I don't care if it's uniform or not, partner. It's what I'm wearing. You know, when you hired me, I don't know if you realize, but you hired a Katamari lover, and this is just what you got to deal with, S.A. Like, I probably it's not going to go the way I plan, but I feel like it's a good idea. Let's get outside. We got to go. We got to get, get outside, dude. Dude, I, that's what those are mittens right there. She's a, a, a what, what kind of cats are those? Not calico, but uh, uh, set, set, it starts with an S. You know, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, she's one of those. Siamese. Siamese. Cat. 
precious too, but she, gosh, she can be mean sometimes, like, like, not mean, mean, like, ah, I don't like you, get away from me, uh, mean in that, uh, mean in the fact that she doesn't really know what she's doing with her claws, and sometimes she makes you bleed on accidents. It's a good thing there's no cats allowed in Japan, right? Ha 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 ha. Pick up everything, anything that is remotely cost money. I'm sure those unicorns are pretty expensive. Dobermans are pretty expensive, I think. Dash, 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 dash. Okay. Pretty dang good. We picked up a lot of gold there at that one point. I feel like that's gonna break it for the most part. Anyway. I hope we unlock some more levels, man. I'm kind of nervous about the whole... Because some of these levels, like, you guys don't have. Some of the DLC levels. Or, I mean, that costs money, you know? I feel like they shouldn't have, but... Because the game itself is just like... You know. I did get a ton of expensive things, dude. Give me my score. Oh, games... Or Rich was number... Dude, Rich was number two, and I still got 97 points. Jesus. I think we're doing good. Oh, I got a little crown too. Nice. But you know. We'll figure it out. Oh, that's a pretty Venus. First unlockable Venus. Dang right, dude. But I gotta if you mind helping me unlock some more Like some some of this game may just be building more planets. You know what I mean? Like it's not oh there's there's just one spawned right now. Um but like maybe it's not so much spawning, um, we'll see, how, how, am I, how am I gonna say this? Maybe it's not so much, uh, oh my god, I'm trying, trying to get my brain together here. I'm just happy to be playing this game. Like maybe it's not so much points and size as it is how many of them that you have. That might be possible, it's completely possible. Um, wish I really knew. But then again, maybe, I mean, it's probably not this way because then there would literally be no challenge with the exception of trying to get the Katamari big enough of just beating the level. That might be the, the whole deal. That's pretty cool. Man. Ever wondered what it would be like on the inside of one of those? Now you know. Come on, get me out of here. Get me out of here, man. I'm stuck. All right, I... And I start picking up more stuff because this, this is about to be a nightmare. Sometimes you're just too small, you know. But yeah, I'm, I'm familiar. Mm. Dude, I think. Do uh, you think this game was like popular in Japan, though? You know, that's something me and Josh were thinking about. It's like, just because something's extremely popular over here that came from Japan doesn't mean that it is as popular in Japan. Like, there's a reason it was exported, you know? It wasn't exported because it was super successful. It was exported because they knew their American audience would buy it versus their own audience. You know what, you know what I mean? Because they got things going over there, going on over there that we as Americans, have, or well, me, has never been exposed to just as like a standard, like, this is <laughs> the way it is, but, uh, I don't, I don't know why I'm trying to go with that, but I, I just, I, 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 I'm sure if they're, they're aware of their own, like, popularity, you know, where, like, for example, like, okay, I, I make Let's Plays, alright, but let's say I made Let's Plays in a, in a town that didn't play video games, in that town, I would not be popular. I would be viewed as like wasting my time. So in real life, pretty much. But in like a video game community, people would regard me as, you know, someone of interest, right? I'm not necessarily popular or famous or anything like that. We're just talking about I would get along better with another, with a culture of gamers than I would, let's say, a culture of construction workers or something like that. You see what I'm saying? That, that difference, apply that to like a nationality. Do you think Japan is aware of their own success in America? I personally think they are. There's no way, like, their biggest export, which is probably anime, like, like 
these there's like major studios and American companies buying their products. I mean, there's no way they can't be. But I, I would question why is their stuff not popular over there? Is it just because like that's just another day to them? You know, like you go to Nashville, it's just another day of construction, right? You go to Decatur, it's just another day of nothing, you know? So I don't really know how the... How that, uh... What would you call that? That stigma. Well, not, not a stigma, but, uh... I don't know if that... Would go both ways. I, that's just what I'm trying to figure out. So, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I didn't write the rules, man. I just, I just play the games and, and watch the TV shows. You know what I'm saying? I write the songs, I write the songs, you know? Let's get outside, man. Let's go somewhere where we're more needed in the outdoors. Dude, Anna was sunburned today, man. She had to go to, like, some softball game, and she didn't wear any sunscreen, and for some reason, Mother Nature decided to let the sun shine instead of it be being winter, and she came in, and, like, her face was, was red, and she's like, I got sun poisoning, and I thought, oh, my God, are you okay? And she said, the doctor said that. I'm like, man, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. They're really fun for Okay, these masks right here, I was missing some of these masks, ladies and gentlemen. I do remember that, okay? So if you can, like, run into or get every one of these masks or every one of them that'll fall, you know, just be sure to pick them up, man, because I know I was missing some of these. That is, I do remember that. So I try to keep an eye out stuff like that, but I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to do a very good job of it. Because it's been so long now, I, I, you know, I completed the collection last year, and it's hard to believe, man, that it has literally been that long since I was doing this, but... Excuse me, Mr. Baseball Man! You just wait till I'm bigger. Wait, I'm gonna find you, and I'm gonna pick you up, and you're gonna be shot into space and burning at billions of ohms and d degrees and fiery death for you. You just wait. You just freaking wait. I don't think I'm going to get it. I've got to make some serious progress here, and I am not doing a good job of this right now. Uh, I need to get i need to get some more, like, in close proximity. I need to go inside another store or something or start picking up people. I will pick up people. I can do it. I've, I've done it. Just ask Hayden. He knows. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to make it. I mean, the, I mean, the bigger you get, the bigger stuff you can pick up, which means, like, it accelerates... You know, like you're able to pick, the bigger stuff you're able to pick up, like it makes your size bigger, bigger, you know, or faster, you know what I mean? But that still doesn't change the fact that you've only got 40 seconds to find, like, a small child and pick them up. Well, there we go. We can pick up people now. Yeah, I do remember them advertising this. I don't think it was this one on Let's Play. It was, uh, it was Katamari Damashi. But I remember just falling in love with it, man. And even then, like, I, I didn't know then how interested in the culture I was. And then, like, fast forward 15 years, and here I am planning a trip there. And I don't like to travel, man. I like to go to work, come home, and play some music, play some video games. And I just try not to ask a lot of people. And, but, you know, now I'm planning a trip literally halfway across the world. <laughs> this game is exciting. This is this is history, baby, as Murphy Lee would say. But anyway, what else has been going on in the world, ladies and gentlemen? Man, nothing. Wow, what a Katamari. Well, this Katamari is good enough for a comment. Let's see, we got number one's Japan. It's pretty big. Oh man. Talk about a sorry comet. You know, whatever that was, some kind of stethoscope. Some kind of inverted steth. Ooh! Dude, that looks like the bomb from Halo 2, man. That doesn't look like a comet. Do comets really look like that, though? I wonder. I'm a party pooper. What? No, I'm not asking anybody. I am. I am the party. I remember this one time, Hugh Hefner had a party, and I couldn't make it, so we just shut it down. So, hello? You can't just tell me I'm not the party dog. Breaking my heart. 
guess we go over here. Oh, see, and that's about another one. Okay, so I'm thinking maybe it, it's not really the, uh... The whole, does that say the Hubble Telescope? If it did, that's amazing. Hubble, oh, okay, I was about to say. It's gotta be maybe a little bit of copyright infringement there, I'm not sure. But anyway. Dude, it's hard to believe. Like these Let's Plays, man, are 360's finally shutting down. It's hard to believe. Oh, that's a pretty category. Okay, let's see, where would be a good place to start? Right there. Yeah, oh, until the teddy bear. Un hashtag until the teddy bear. Man, that almost sounds like the Bomberman theme song from Bomberman uh, Heroes. Oh. Anyway. You know, it's got that one that's like da 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 and then it goes on that little break. You got five minutes to draw a bunch of constellations, man. I don't really know like what a constellation makes. <laughs> you know, we've never even left our planet. I, I highly doubt there's a anybody else can tell me what a constellation makes. Oh, these dang teddy bears. One of these days, I'm going to get my revenge on these teddy bears, man. It <laughs> goes all the way back to uh, Black Ops Zombies, or World War II Zombies, or World at War Zombies, I'm sorry. And, uh, yeah, World at War II Zombies, that's, that's the way you should say that. Getting revenge on these dang teddy bears. Football, yeah, who likes football? You, you're wrong. You just need to start watching hockey. Anyway, there we go. Yellow tulips. I, I'm down with tulips. I don't care. You're down with tulips. What does even that mean? We start finding places, dude. We're not. We got 23 out of 88. I mean, we got plenty of time. It's just it's nerve wracking. Oh, we can get the teddy. The vengeance on the teddy bears has begun. Would like that cat, please. Everybody likes cats. Dude, look at that big ass peacock, man. <laughs> I think a lot of this too is the fantasy of the game. You know, like this stuff could literally never happen. But it's it's just it's beautiful chaos, man. Absolute beautiful chaos. And it's only gonna get better. When are they gonna make another Katamari game? I'd I'd probably buy it, you know, make one for the the newest generation of consoles, usher in a new generation of uh, Katamari players. I'd do. I will I will help lead the way on that. Can I please be like a a general in that army, please? The Katamari army. I'm down. Let's just let's just get everything, every anything that moves and what doesn't, and things that don't move. Let's just get it all, man. Dude, picking up grills, man. Nice grill, homie. That's what they tell me at, when I was at college. But it's a pretty big bear too. We have all kinds of new things as well. Um. Okay, we're starting to run into a problem now. We got about a minute and a half to pick up uh, about. If I knew exactly what a constellation makes, I imagine that big bird, that Moltres flying there, probably has something. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. That's one thing. You kind of slow down. Like when you get bigger, the dash doesn't work as efficiently. It's not the only bad thing. But then again, you're literally picking up everything inside when you get that big, so. Alright, man. We are running out of time. We gotta find some more constellative stuff. I think it's things in the shape of stars. Something to that effect. I don't really know. Don't quote me on that. But I don't think we're gonna get it, man. I'm actually kind of nervous. And I've picked up so much stuff, but like maybe things are on fire. I don't. Start picking up buildings or something. I don't know. 
to. We're not gonna make it, man. We are not gonna make it. This is horrible. I mean, it was a good, a good try, you know, but it's not gonna be. Yeah, at least you get to keep your. Uh, at least you get to keep all your collection, but still, it's not gonna be enough, man. I'm trying to get in there. I'm trying to get in there. It's not going to be enough. It's, it's not going to be enough. I'll do the best I can. Or maybe you don't need to get all that much. Oh, well, yeah, you probably do. I don't know how much more I could have gotten, though. There, there's literally nothing else here. But, all right, all done. Off we go to the Princeton. I, I, I guess... But the way it looked like, it said you need to get at least 88. I mean, that... And that I did not do. But when you don't make the grade or make the the size, what happens is he actually just shuts you down and like it pretty much says game over. So I guess you don't have to get 88. You may have to get a certain size, but I don't know. I don't know. I know I couldn't have got much more. What are we looking at here, partner? 94! Dude, that's pretty good. I don't think we got a present, but we did get one of the cousins. Ooh, pretty. I just made an entire galaxy. You're welcome. <laughs> anyway. So. But yeah, man. If anybody's playing this game, watches this, and needs help with those online achievements, I am here, home dog. If you need help with anything. Um. Did we do this? I'm pretty sure we did. We did everything here. Yeah. Um. That's DLC. Egg school, we did that. Pretty sure this is DLC, but I... Yeah, Munch... Yeah, Munch's Manor is DLC. There's gonna be something over there eventually. Oh, there's... There's another one. Okay. Alright, let's... Let's let's finish out the planet up here. Might as well. I like to thank everybody for watching. Keep it real. Keep doing you. We're gonna make uh, two more apps. So it's gonna be an absolute pleasure. Keep it real. And peace.